Hello everyone. Sorry if I look half dead to you. It's my first night off. I've been working the last four nights. Tonight I'm not. So I tried to sleep today. I slept only like three hours. Really tired. Got up trying to, uh, to do some cleaning up. And I'm building right now something I bought myself yesterday. A new meat smoker that I'm gonna use during next winter. So here's the beast. It's a small smoker made out of aluminum. It doesn't look too solid to me, but you know what? Solidity here is not the main goal. The main goal is to smoke meat. So I'm sure it will do it nicely. I bought it cheap in a cell in a store that I won't name. But you know what? If you're from Canada, you know that store. You'll figure it out. I'm building it right now because I'm off tonight. I don't know if you knew already, but I built myself a smoker two years ago. There's a French movie called Le Fumoir where I show how I made it. I'm planning to dub it in English so everybody could watch it. The main idea here is to let you know that even though I have already a smoker, I bought one. Why? The reason is quite simple. My smoker, I cannot use it during the winter time. My barrel is tidied up in my shed. My wood is wet. My land is full of snow, so I cannot build up my smoker. And I don't think the structure would hold up with the weight of the snow, the barrel, the meat, and the wood stove. So I had to find another alternative, but myself that smoker. I'm gonna be able to smoke some meat during the winter. So building it right now, like I said, and I'm doing it as I'm watching the movie Almost Famous. It's the second time I'm watching it. It's a really good movie. If you've never seen it, go ahead and rent it, watch it. It's a good movie about the 70s, the music, the rock, the past uh, peace and love era. It's a must see. just finished building it up. I'm gonna be honest, it's bigger than I thought. I was afraid it would be too small, but it's not. Seriously, it's a good size, so I'm kind of happy about it. I'll show you how it works. So here are the doors. The first section contains the charcoal. Over it, there's a bowl for some water and for the juice dribbling. And there's a grill where I can put my meat. There's a second section where I can still smoke some meat. There's another bowl for some water and for the juice dripping off my meat. There's a grill. And finally, there's the top of my smoker. There's that thing that serves as an air vent. I can open it up to lose some heat or some smoke. And I don't know if you can see those little metal wire. You can use them to suspend some meat like sausages and stuff like that. You can then close it, but it's not really uh, leak tight, but it's okay. If I want, I can use it as a charcoal barbecue. I just have to remove the second section. I just keep the first section where my charcoal is. I still have my grill. I can remove the bowl where the water goes and I can put the top on just to prevent stuff from falling over my food. The top doesn't really fit on the first section, but you know what, it's not perfect, we know it. I already have a charcoal barbecue, so I don't think I would use this one, but it's always good to know that you can still use it. So there it is, that's my new smoker. It's really a basic one, but I think it will help me smoke some meat during the winter, and that's my goal here. I hope you enjoyed that movie. It wasn't very long, but you know what? The goal was to show you how I make things work. And 
just shows you as well that many more movies are coming up this summer. See you next time.